What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to another edition of the Jericho Report Weekly News Briefing. It is Sunday, the 23rd of May, 2021, almost through May. I hope you're ready for another week of madness because it's been vaccine tyranny all around. And as always, the first link below will take you over to the Patreon post. That's where you can find all of the links to all these stories. Let's get into it. Door-to-door -door jab hit squads fight COVID. Oh, what? The Indian variant is now in the UK, and they got door-to-door -door hit squads going around. It's in the United States, too, just like I said weeks ago. Two children first in North Texas to be diagnosed with the vi with the variant plaguing India. Watch, it's going to spread all over. And you know what? It's going to be blamed on the people who didn't get the... Well, we'll get into that in a minute. Joe Biden, ultimately those who are not vaccinated will end up paying the price. Yes, that's who it'll be blamed on when this thing spreads everywhere. Texas governor bans local government schools from requiring face masks. It will be blamed on all of the people who didn't get the vaccine and took off their faces. Oh, they put everyone else at risk and look what happened. I hope I'm wrong. I really do. Uh, commission signs third contract with biotech Pfizer for additional 1.8 billion doses. This is out of the EU. Be advised, uh, mainstream doctors back home in the United States are refusing to see, uh, refusing to treat vaccine damaged patients because they don't want to get involved in controversial diagnosis. I bet. 57-year-old uh, uh, mocked anti vaskers dead seven days later from the j and I don't feel sorry for you at all. Who's laughing now? COVID vaccine trials and animals were stopped because they kept dying. Have you heard about this? I didn't, but I'll put a link to this. Interesting. Uh, this video here, you really want to chat. This, this woman here goes into the effects of shedding, being around people who have been vaccinated, and, and side effects of being around these people. Be advised, U.S. investigates second suspected case of mystery syndrome near the White House, as if COVID wasn't enough. Now we got this mystery syndrome. I got a couple more here in the general Ben leaked audit numbers. Show Trump uh, carried Arizona by over a million votes. Why is nobody doing anything? Well, they're doing plenty. In fact, you know, just this week, uh, House approved January 6th commission bill. Because let's not go after the fraud. Let's not go after the real problem. Let's go, let's go after all of the people who tried to point the problem out. Though it's the real threat there, right? Those homegrown domestic terrorist people. Because there's no, there's no, no law enforcement agency in this country. No judge, no, 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 no FBI agent, and nobody anywhere. That, that's, I mean, everyone saw what happened. We, we all know. The fraud that it is nobody does a thing over to financial news how major u.s stock indexes fared on friday it looks like the dow uh, rose 123 for the week it closed 34 207 looks like for the week it was down 174 but it's still above 34 put a link to the recap data 39 million households uh, including most u.s children will get three thousand six hundred dollars stimulus and monthly payments be advised more free shit on the way u.s treasury calls for stricter cryptocurrency compliance with irs says they put oh, of course they you, you slaves think you're going to operate behind the scenes and not pay your taxes come on now put a link to that ongoing gas shortage leaves nearly 90 percent of dc put now this when did this come out on may 17 so hopefully this fuel situation is getting under control san francisco law legalizing shopping enforces closure of small uh, stores leaving residents without indeed i got one here walgreens closes 17 stores in san francisco due to out of control shoplifting hey the same thing is happening in st louis you listen to the scanners at night people are walking in to, to walgreens are just walking out with carts full of stuff and nobody's stopping them nobody's doing a thing i'll put a link to it and of course because of their no, no pursuit policy the cops don't chase anybody so new york offers look you need some extra monies new york offers five million dollar lottery scratch off tickets look that's what your life means to them a scratch off ticket i'll put a link to this world economic forum urges companies to fire unvaccinated employees as part of jobs reset but deletes tweet after the backlash yeah the slaves don't want to come look like i said they don't have to hold you down and force it into your arm they just got to make it impossible for you to live put a link to this i got a couple more in the financial men biden wants to build a national ev charging system under well, that's where our priorities should be definitely and former fbi director uh gave $100,000 to private trust for Joe Biden's grandchildren, discussed future work options with Hunter as middleman. No shocker there. Over to New World Order and Police State News. This is where I stop and ask you to share this video because there's important stuff. Prepare to be pissed off. Warning might be some language. Uh, get vaccinated or wear a mask until you do. The vice president is now echoing Joe Biden's uh, stuff from last week. Everybody's coming out with this. Get vaccinated or what? Make me, bitch. Put a link in. Hillary Clinton. Hillary Clinton. It's pretty simple. Get vaccinated. Get your life back. You see, these people, they think they're your masters. They took your life from you. Now they're telling you in order to get your life back, it's pretty simple. You got to take the poison. How can no one see this? I'll put a link to it. FBI warns of prison time. Prison time if you present. You don't got to worry about me presenting a fake vaccine card because I ain't getting this shit, period. 
Santa Clara County businesses must now track vaccination status of employees. What did I tell you a year ago? Knock, knock. Have you heard that? Have you had the vaccine yet? California sends out thousands to check. Knocking on your door. Do you have the vaccine? We're here to give you the poison. Roll up your sleever, right? Uh... Uniformed troops go to bars in 7-Eleven in Dallas to randomly vaccinate younger crowd people. What All that stuff we talked about in 2009. Where are all the people from back then? Hello? Where's all my trolls and haters and all these people? Oh, you're crazy. This stuff will never happen. Really? 12 years later, here we are. NHS app will contain... Uh, COVID passport, I think this is out of the UK, be advised, COVID passport in the UK, White House partners with dating apps to, in vaccine push, make sure you're, if you're going to meet somebody, make sure they're vaccinated. We may get to the point, Bloomberg opinion, we may get to the point where we must force people to get the COVID vaccine for the public good. Does it sound like Nazi Germany to you for the public good? I'll put a link to this. I got a few more. Let's get through these. Kamala Harris. COVID is an opportunity to transform. Oh, you're damn right it is. But she's talking in code. She's talking about the New World Order. See, if you don't know about the New World Order, you don't know what she's really saying here. It's, of course, a, a, an opportunity to transform America. In fact, bring a fertility crisis. Scientists say plummeting sperm counts caused by everyday products. Or is it caused by all the vaccines and all the shit they put in the water? And, of course, the stuff they put in the food, all the GMOs. What did Bill Gates say? If we do a really good job with vaccines, we can get that population down. It's happening, folks. I got one more here. We got an update. The shooting video was released in the Andrew Brown Jr. All of the cops dodge charges. And if you watch the video, it appears to me at least like he was driving away when he was murdered. You know where they got lucky on that one? The fact that it happened in a not-so-populated area. It didn't happen in a... Uh, uh, like a metropolitan, highly populated area. It happened way over on the East Coast in a little town somewhere. So they got lucky there, probably. They're not going to have a lot, of, a lot of backlash out of that one. Israel, over to World War III news. Israel and Hamas agree to Gaza truce. Biden pledges assistance. It's peacetime again. Next week, we'll kill each other again. Of course, assistance. Biden approves $735 million weapons sale to Israel. Put a link to that. We got, uh, let me get rid of all this pop-up stuff. After backing Assad, Iran and Russia c compete for influence and spoils of war. Put a link to that. Uh, Pentagon chief unable to talk to Chinese military leaders despite repeated attempts. We don't want to talk to you. Bring back orange man with hot wife. Uh, Biden taps career diplomat as special envoy to North Korea. Speaking of North Korea, Joe Biden rejects Trump's approach to North Korea. Says he won't give to Kim Jong-un. You mean uh, little Kim won't talk to you is what you mean, Joe. In fact, he's too busy. Kim Jong-un bans mullets and skinny jeans. Why would you ban skinny jeans? What's wrong with you, Kim? And I got one more. Iran deliberately shot down plane full of passengers. This is something that happened a while back but it was just ruled by a Canadian judge. Over to Earth Changes in 2012 news now. Looked like we had some big quakes. I got it set up for six points and above for the past week. We had a 6.5 on the 21st, a 7.4 on the 21st. That was a pretty good one over there. 6.0 on the 21st, 6.7 on the 19th. Lots of earthquakes. The earth is shaking and rattling and rolling. I'll put a link to the recap data. Terrified onlookers flee as Chinese skyscraper wobbles. What? But they're saying it wasn't caused by an earthquake. What well, was it? Like Operation Blue Beam or was it HARP? Something going on? You zapping that building? Uh, China, Wuhan tornado kills eight, injures hundreds. I didn't know they had tornadoes in Wuhan. Put a link to that. Meanwhile, back in the United States, Gulf tropical threat to douse uh, flood weary Texas and Louisiana. Be advised, my friends, to the south. Uh, we got some broken trains this week. Crew responded to train derailment in Iowa, a big smoky train. Meanwhile, over in Minnesota, you had 50 cars leave the tracks of a broken train. Put a link to that. We got largest iceberg in the world breaks off Antarctica, European space. Big iceberg floating around. Be advised, you know, human beings are destroying the earth and all that. Or maybe it's just a natural thing that happens. China's rover sends back its first selfies from Mars. Look, I'm on Mars. Put a link to that. Obama on UFO videos. We don't know exactly what they are. There was a video here, but it's black. You can probably reload it and get it. I know where one of them is. Racist mayor. The, 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 the brown alien up in Chicago is racist. She only wants to talk to brown journalists. And it's not a racist thing. I mean, you can't tell me she doesn't look like an alien, just like, you know, Diane Frankenstein looks like Count Chocula's wife. I don't know. Over to Strange and Bizarre News, we got 76-year-old with COVID-19 wakes up moments before her cremation. I'm not dead! Get me out of this box! How about get me out of this jail? Georgia judge offers some reduced sentences to offenders who get... You, you, we'll let you out of jail if you just get the vaccine. I mean, do you see what's happening here? Put a link to this. 20 U.S. states liquefy vaccine murder people and spread their their 
flesh goo on food. This wouldn't surprise me at all. In fact, in the movie The Matrix, they liquefied the dead to feed them to the living, didn't they? Put a link to this from Natural News. Woman makes uh, wakes up to blood, speaking of goo, dripping from her sin. Apparently, the dead body above uh, finally started to leak. It, it got down into the sea. I mean, you, uh, you put that in a movie somewhere. Uh, teen 18, an ankle monitor uh, snatches four-year-old boy from bed, stabs him to death. What did that little boy do to you? You know, there's a special place in hell for people like that. Woman kills her two kids with meat cleaver in Arizona. What? I got an idea. Let's bring back South Carolina. Brings back the, the firing squads and the electric chair. Yes, fire these people down. Electrocute them to death. And then we'll wash our hands afterwards. But not like this. Car engulfed in flames when driver smoking cigarette uses hand sanitizer. Pull <laughs> link to that. Be advised, it contains alcohol. Might be flammable. Massive drunken fight uh, leaves the lady uh, knocked out on the ground, unconscious. <laughs> ah! Ah! That's gotta hurt. Put a link to that. Fargo man commits suicide in court after bad news from the judge. Was it that man? Ah! Colorado man accused of missing wife's death cast Trump vote in her... Well, why not? Did, was she a Biden supporter? Did you guys get into it? Like, you're not gonna vote for Trump? I kill you and I'll steal your vote. But I don't know if that's what happened. Uh, NYC uh, Pride Parade bans police. Gay officers are disheartened. That's all I got for news. For all the news, please check my favorites. We got people saying that the, that the shot is possibly connected to Bluetooth Connect. I, I don't know. I don't know about that. I haven't really looked into that. Lady arrested at school board meeting over a mask dispute. Body cam. Oh, you got to check out this body cam. A Baltimore man fatally shot after killing three people, and he set the house on fire. Uh, wild police chase. I got all kinds of fresh news in my favorites. Check out my favorites. Thank you to everybody who continues to post content, keeping everybody informed. You guys are doing awesome. More. I got a couple shout outs this week. Shout out to the Trump supporter who goes on absolutely epic rant at gas station, says everything we've all wanted to say. If you scroll down here, uh, his video, it's a little long, it's about 16, 17 minutes, but the man makes some great points screaming at a gas station. I had to give a shout out to him. And shout out to the Nashville gas station who puts meme of Hunter Biden on their sign. Hope gas prices don't get too high. Uh, there's Joe Biden, there, uh, Hunter Biden. I'm high. That's all the news I got for this week, guys. If you like to report, please give me a thumbs up or thumbs down. If you think it sucked, it's the worst of YouTube. You never want to again. Please rate, though. It helps me around. You can also support me on Patreon or directly with PayPal. I put a lot into these reports. It takes a lot of it. Friday nights, I spend all night putting the links together. Then Saturday evening, I shoot the video. Then Sunday, you got the news. That's how I do things. You can also follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Gab. Make sure you're following me on BitChute in case something happens to the YouTube. That's all I got. What's coming next week? Door-to-door -door, uh, vaccine squads? Anybody knocking on your door? Please report it in the comments if there is somebody that you got your vaccine, huh? Huh? Anybody ask you in the grocery store uh, why you're not wearing a mask? Did you get the vaccine? You know, because people aren't supposed to ask you this, but they probably will. You know, over the next months, well, my prediction is we're going to see the Indian variant uh, blow up in the United States, and that's going to be playing. That's going to be blamed on all the anti-vaxxers and anti-maskers and all this. So it's going to be you know a hot summer in my opinion, but we'll see what happens. That's all I got for now. You guys take care, stay safe, have a good week, remain vigilant, be ready for anything at any time. I love you very much. I will see you. All.